Welcome back, my YouTube family. I haven't talked to y'all in a while. I miss y'all. I wish everyone peace, love, and happiness. But let's talk. Let's have a little topic today. Let me get me a little coffee. You know, they always I gotta hand me some coffee. But I wanted to do a little topic, and you know. I have my notes, always got my notes. And you know, I, I constantly watch Infinite Water, different people I watch on YouTube to keep my spirits up. Um, so, you know, when topics come to my mind that I know I need to hear, sometimes I wanna make a video that maybe might help someone else. It's my way of passing it on. So, today's video, first, let's get a sip of coffee. Today's video about is about um, we always wonder why certain people. Oh, let's let me not say we all. I always wonder why certain people come in my life, and I'm discovering that there is in my mind. And if you have more, always you know put little comments down that we can communicate. Comments down below. But the way I see it, it is three reasons why people come into your life. And I'm gonna to try to give you an example of what I feel that different people came into my life. So I have the three reasons why people come into your life is, one is a lesson to be learned. The second one is a blessing to be received. And the third one is something that they will bring into your life to make you grow, make you more wise, as you go on, but it was for growth is the third. So you have lessons, blessings, and growth. It's the three reasons why people come into your life. So as we take a little sip, I can give you the first one. Let's talk about lessons. I have one, and I have this, the only reason why I keep bringing this one up, and hi, my coworkers, they'll know. So I'm, I never want to say names because wish everyone best. So I had a coworker that once they were there, we clashed. And I rarely clash with people because I kind of adapt to, you know, whatever, you know. So we clashed. And it was like, oh, didn't want to even go into the office because of the person. So, um, and I'm sorry, I got my coffee. Let me put my coffee down. So with, with, with that, I had to figure out eventually, and I was still on my, and I'm still is, on my, my learning journey to learn me. Um, so it was like, it had to be a reason why, you know, because I always, you know, I'm trying to be happy, but it was always that. It was always that conflict all the time. So I had to figure out, why was this person in my life? I found out it was for a lesson to be learned. I have a problem with, I let people, or I had a problem, I'm gonna put it in the past tense, even though I'm still working on it, where I let people control my moods. If someone says something, I'm quick to react, you know, I have a mouth on me, let's just say that. But this person was teaching me to patience. And that's how I took it. Eventually, once I realized this is why, oh, could not trigger me anymore. New word, you know, time, this um, 2021, people use trigger, could not trigger me anymore. And I refuse, and that's, that's the way I took back control. So I don't want this video being long, so let's go to the next one. That's one of my examples of lessons. I know I had a whole lot of other people come in my life and taught me lessons because lessons in general, just me being an RV, people taught me, or the, the, the RVers that have been doing it for years have taught me so much. RV community is a beautiful community, very friendly. So let me go on to the second reason why a person will come into your life. We said the second one is blessings. I have received so many nice people in my life that have been blessings have, and going back to teaching me something from these people 
I mean, just as, um, let me give you one example. I, I want to give you an RV example. So when I first time I went down to, um, with um, my vehicle down to Florida, I knew nothing about, you know, the bugs. And y'all have, it's a video up there. I'll, I'll put it up there. So I knew nothing about love. I'm like, oh my goodness, going down there and saw that. So when I got there, quickly, the people there knew exactly like, look, this is what you need. And I did put it in the video, Coca-Cola and during a certain time of month, you just don't want to be traveling up and down Florida because of the love bugs. 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 So that's just one quick little lesson or blessing I'm saying, but there is so many. I mean, 2020 to me was a blessing. A lot of people said they didn't like 2020. I, I, I love every adventure that comes my way. So let me go on to another one because this could be a long video if I don't keep going. So the third one is growth. Oh, growth. Man, I have to say, between me learning myself, I have grown. I am so open to whatever comes my way before it was like you know i had to have things certain way i was a control freak i don't let certain things re i don't react to what people say as fast as i used to and sometimes i still slip but i am growing i know i'm growing every day i wake up and say thank you universe i am trying to eat healthy i say try because it's always a challenge but food-wise, I'm more conscious of what I eat. I'm more conscious of the people I'm around when it comes to energy. So growth is there. So fam, tell me some of the things that you have learned why certain people come, good or bad. Because some people come into your life, there it's not always good things either. But again, you're either going to get a lesson from that, it's coming as a blessing, or it's for growth. So fam, that was a quick one. And let's have a little sip of coffee before we leave. And no, take something from whoever comes to your, in your life because I guarantee you'll be better off for it. So family, enjoy. You might even see this one again because I got another video I'm thinking about. But fam, let's say a little sippy. But then I hope everyone is living their dreams, living as positive as they can, you know, and I always call it our crazy world we have out here. Don't make, don't let our crazy world make you crazy, you know? So I don't, I, I mean, certain things we have to deal with and I understand that, but your happiness is an internal job internal job an internal thing you create your happiness happiness can be anywhere happiness can be in your backyard with just some music and making it your own happiness can be in your room in your shower in your hot tub whatever you want happiness is where you put it my happiness and i'm taking this from an rv and right now i'm in orlando with my family Thank you, universe. Family is so important. So fam, let me get out of here. Go out there and enjoy your family. Enjoy your life. Do what you want. You can do anything you want. You just put your mind to it.